Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is the Wix Online Meeting 166 at the end of March, end of the first quarter of 2019. Today we're going to have a short meeting because we're doing triage. I'll talk about that in the agenda, um, and we don't have much to triage. But anyway, uh, as always, these meetings are recorded for those of you that aren't with us right here, right now, but watching in the future. Uh, like I said, we're going to do triage, and then we'll do questions, comments, things like that, anything that comes to mind. Uh, so let's go ahead and blow through triage because it won't take us too long. Bob, ready? Let's go. All right. Yay, triage. Um, I still haven't started this conversation. I will. Uh, vote of 2017-2019. I assume that's vote of in both of those. With no workloads. Um, without selecting any workloads. Oh, NVS, I see. NVS, if you don't select any workloads, vote of will appear to install successfully, but when you create an error, that it can't find that. Hmm. So I wonder what component template wizard interface is in, in Visual Studio. Right. And I guess we probably should have a dependency on that, not just core editor, I guess. Probably, I guess. I mean, that's the way I understand you're supposed to do it. Yeah, I just, I, I well, <laughs> for those who've been listening for years, I've never been a fan of the model that they took with, um, you know, this, install on demand approach, if we declare a dependency on on whatever things include template wizard interface, you're going to get something installed when you install Votive. Yeah, but yes, true, correct, and therefore, if you want Votive to work, you need this thing, so that's, I guess, just the way it goes. If uh, we can declare a dependency on something small, I'm fine with this. That's my hope. So... Um, yeah, let's toss it in four. Let's toss it in four oh and see if we can get it fixed there, because we're not going to do it in three. Um, and I'll go poke our residents, Visual Studio experts, to see if they know off the top of their head or whatever, real quick. But we'll see if that's easy. Isn't it outside of which three or four? Yeah, but we don't have a place for that, so I was thinking let's just put it in four and then it'll show up in a bucket that I do review view as opposed to like 4x or 3x. Okay. Default service install not documented. Documentation doesn't say that's true by default. Well, Blair is correct. Normally the default by yes. And file calls out vital because it's weird. Yeah. And then we did the little magic to reverse the default. Right. Sorry, that's what I meant. It's weird. It is well, reverse. sorry, I was specifically talking about what the, oh. the next phase of what this person is requesting, which is FIDAL should be default for services like it is for files. And it's messed up and special and weird for files because we started out with the perhaps wrong default. Yeah, and we've never come up with a good name for the opposite. Because non-vital just gets weird when you're like, non-vital, no. So it's not non-vital, it's vital. Yeah. I heard a story yesterday, quick digression. Um, I don't know if this is a joke or an actual story, but uh, no, the guy said he saw it on a YouTube video, so therefore it's probably a joke. But who knows? Um, I was just listening as people were talking. And he says, there's this professor teaching uh, class, and in the class he says that in Russian, I think it was Russian, that two negatives do not make a positive, so a double negative does not make it positive. And I kind of thought, does that make it more negative? Um, but then the professor went on and said that uh, there is no language where uh, two positives make a negative, and a student in the back said, yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> anyway, yeah. uh, we don't have an answer for that part. Uh, we, <laughs> someone could document all of the defaults if they wanted. I agree with Blair that when it's not documented, but we probably don't say that either. So, oh, and that's what he says right here. So, yeah, we could toss this in 4X, and if someone wants to do the update, that'd be fine. That'd be great. Well, so, so but let's talk about the default. The default? For, is that not the next issue? No. Oh, oh, okay. 
All right. I see. This, this, this has sure. two issues here. Oh, I see. This is two and it's, one. Got it's it. not documented, and the suggestion is that it's the wrong default. I see. Um, I, I don't disagree, although this is a little weird because, um, well, no, not really. The service install being vital doesn't change, um, like, the start behavior. No, it doesn't. It would be nice if it did because that would address the, you know, I can't rely on my GACT components. Uh, yes, right. Um, but I don't think service config lets you do that. Service install, it seems vital, should default to true. All right, we can toss it before. I'm I'm basically okay with that. I still wish we had a good word for non-vital so we could flip it around and get the default right. I, I think we should go back and start using meh for that. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let, we could toss this in four. Obviously, we can't break it in three, so. Yeah. All right, and then hit look at marching. Oh, service config. Windows installer reference is incorrect. Oh, great. Cool. Uh, I guess we toss that in. Let's toss it 314. We're going to do another 314 build, and I'll do a quick sweep. Give it to me in 314. I'll do a quick sweep on it, and I'll just fix it. Okay. Um, just because it's easier to do that than to have anybody else to go fight with it. Um, oh, I should talk about that. I should have put that on the agenda. Anyway, uh, uh, spoiler, we'll talk about 314 on the comments, questions. Um, all right, that was pretty easy. Am I missing anything? That seems really easy. Yes, I know we need to talk about these, but I don't want to talk about these bottom two right now. All right, going back then. Questions and comments. All right, so uh, I mentioned a 314. Um, Heath did the work in a pull request to do the signing service off of .NET Foundation and all that, which is great. He said he would do that a while ago, and he's come around to doing it. That's fantastic. Um, so I hope maybe tomorrow, if not hopefully early next week, um, to get that all tested and verified that the work works against the real servers for us, um, and we'll then get a 314 build out, including a crash fix, because we said, as we discussed, that if he finished the service, the signing service for us, that we'd go f dig out a, the nasty crash fix for the Dunder Framework team in that horse trade from a while ago. So anyway, I hope all of that probably not tomorrow um, but by Monday, Tuesday next week I hope I can get all of that done and um, pushed out so we have that fix and I'll do that doc fix while I'm in the Wix.chun real fast and I'll take um, a sweep probably it's probably going to take a little bit longer than that though because I don't think um, the back end is completely ready oh lovely so we have our side but they don't have the back end side so we're stuck up. okay fine then, well, if I get hung up by anything, then hopefully it won't be my time. Hopefully it will be external processes to us, and we'll just wait for those to get resolved. Um, so anyway, so we're going to get a new 314 build coming out uh, hopefully next week, or as soon as that becomes uh, feasible. <sighs> anyway, so there's that heads up. Anything else people want to talk about? Stuff going on. Quiet out there. It's all right. Cool. All right. Uh, we're going to call this a nice short week. Uh, get this done in about 10 minutes, since we start about five minutes late. Uh, we'll be back in two weeks, right? I don't think anything comes up in Magical in two weeks. Um, hey, our anniversary is next week. Too bad we're not having a meeting then, but that's okay. Um, wow. No, that's, our meeting will be on the 11th. Yep. So... Someone better make some cake, I guess. Yeah, something like that. Um, so, gosh, what is it? 2019, and it was launched in... 15. This is the big one, five. Wow, Wix is 15 years old, publicly. Publicly, yeah. Yeah. I don't know when it was actually... When we V1... I don't know when you want... I never officially marked the V1 date in my head, but it probably was September of 99 probably if I was to pick a date 
Although the name, yeah, the name probably would have been picked in August. So, or July, late July. Anyway, um, wow, 15 years. All right, well, uh, maybe we'll talk about that a little bit. Uh, still, meeting in two weeks, yes. I get no point in, unless we want to shift it up a week. I don't think we should do that. We'll do it in two weeks. Um, as much fun as it might be to be on the anniversary. All right, you guys call it. What do you think? Should we stay on the two week or shift it just to hit the 15 year anniversary? I'm looking for. Wait, which weeks. is the anniversary? What's the actual day? Uh, April 4th. Oh, it was April 4th. Why yeah. did I think? For some reason, I thought it was the 15th. Four, four, no, it's the fifth. Four, five, two thousand four. Yeah, I think it's four, five, two thousand. <laughs> someone, it someone should know this. <laughs> well, it, it's either it's it's either four, four. I'm pretty sure it's four, five, four. Is the kind of the way I remember it. Um, I can go dig it out, but um, I think it's four. Uh, according to Wikipedia, it was indeed April 5th. Yeah, so that my memory is right. Yeah, it was four days after April 1st, which is the whole, <laughs> and in the fourth month of 2004. So it's like, there's a whole bunch of fours in it, but the date isn't four. The day is five. Right. That was a very sleepless night, a sleepless day. Yeah. 2004, April 4th, 2004, it was a very long day for me. Um Pretty exciting, though. Doing battle with CVS. CVS and SourceForge, yeah, that would have been source SourceForge. Right. That's how old this is. <laughs> Rock and roll. All right, cool. So we'll meet on the 11th, uh, which is six days after the 15th anniversary, which I don't think we can spin into anything, but we'll make it into something. Um, and we'll talk about triage and other things going on in the Wix tool set. So till then... You guys take it easy, and uh, we'll see you around on the mailing list. Bye. Bye. Bye.